Hey guys, what is up? Today, Matthew is going to be painting my wheels. He's gonna show you a little video montage of what he's doing before and after. Right now, they're just silver. He's gonna be painting them either matte black or gloss black, I'm not sure. But stay tuned and he will get back with you when he gets back from the store. All right guys, so I just got back from AutoZone. I'm getting the paint ready. Um, let me show you what I got. So I always use VHT wheel paint. This is a VHT high temperature gloss black. I've got clear coats and I also got primer and which, although I do prep pretty well, typically I don't use primer so I'm gonna try to make this look good for Meredith because um, obviously I don't wanna mess it up on someone else's car. <laughs> so I've got my, uh, Got my jack ready to go. I'm gonna jack it up, put it on uh, these jack stands, take off probably the front two, clean them up real nice, sand them down, um, and then lay them out here on this tarp, start spraying them very lightly, um, and kind of go from there. So we'll see how it turns out. All right, so I just jacked the car up um, and I painted the first two, or I'm sorry, I washed the first two wheels back here. Um, so we're on our way, it's still, it's standing up on those jack stands. Um, you can see the, this is a very important step right here. You have to make sure you clean off all the dust and debris. I'm going to let those dry, get to work a little bit. Then what I'll do is I'll come back, I'll come back and sand them down and then I will start the first coat of primer and we'll go from there. It's a lot of work, it's hot outside. All right, so the wheels are mostly dry. I'm just gonna knock off any dust that I may have on there still. Um, try to get off any more excess water. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop out the center cap and keep that uh, kind of that chrome silver look because you know obviously she's still gonna have some she's still gonna have some chrome on her car so you kind of want it to blend in you don't want to just be all black because that would look kind of funny if you know her wheels are completely blacked in and then um, she has chrome on her grill and her roof rack is gonna be chrome which is actually coming in today so Maybe I'll get that on video, I'm not really sure. But the best thing to do whenever you're painting wheels is uh, you can take a deck of cards and put it around the rim and kind of paint it that way. Or you can, uh, I, I'm thinking about using paper and putting it around the rim. Um, so we'll just kind of see what I what I end up doing there. But I still have to sand them, which is kind of the sketchiest part because you don't want to scratch them up too bad. But you want to scratch them up just enough to where they uh, just enough to where they stick, you know. So as I was saying, I was gonna pop these out. I actually already popped that one out. I just want to make sure that I could do it right without holding the camera. Um, these are super. These are super simple to do. You just take a really small screwdriver, you can take a knife and just pop it out just like that. All right, so now I've got some sandpaper. Um, you wanna keep it kind of light. I've got two 400s. Um, I don't wanna scratch it up too bad. Just enough to where, you know, it sticks.
The last thing you want to do is mess them up and then have to buy new wheels or go to a professional that does this because then you're talking about coming out with some money because uh, you know they like to charge. So just continue doing it all the way around, make sure you get creases a little bit. Alright, so I think this 400 is what I use on my wheels. It doesn't scratch it up too bad, but it'll make it, you know, just enough to where your primer will stick, your paint will stick, and you'll get all that excess get all that excess dirt and everything off. So you can kind of see here, not sure if you can tell that it's a little bit scuffed up. See that versus this. See how smooth that is? There's no way the paint sticks. So that's why we're gonna do that. All right guys, so I took some paper, cut it in half, folded it, or kind of put it into the side of the rim, let it lay over the tire, I found this is a pretty easy way to do it. Typically I use like a deck of cards, but I didn't want to ruin all my cards. So I'm going to try this out. Uh, it looks pretty good. I like that it kind of goes all the way over. So we'll see how it works when I start spraying it. All right, so I got two coats of primer on. They're looking pretty good. They're just now getting dried up. It's about time to add the gloss black on there. So we'll uh, touch back whenever I'm done with the first coat of black. All right, so there's the second coat. They're looking pretty good. They don't even have the clear coat on them. I'm gonna do one more coat. I'm going to do the clear coat, which is also gloss, make them shine pretty good. And then what do we have here? Where this crossbars just came in. You know, I'm loving the fact that I'm getting to customize two cars because this is what I've always done. Um, so I'm pretty excited. Hopefully Meredith likes it. All right, so there's the last coat of the gloss black, and man, does it look good. Well, I might need to redo my wheels after doing this because this looks absolutely amazing. I'm gonna throw a clear coat on this, and these two are finished. All right, so I put three coats of the gloss black on there after the two coats of primer. And then I just put two more coats of gloss clear on there. As you can see, it's got a nice little shine. That's the last two coats that I'm doing. I'm absolutely pumped about the way that they came out. You can see the nice shine. I mean, they're gonna look so good on the car. I just have to do the other two. I probably won't film those other ones just because you already saw the process on these. 
but I will pop up the final product along with throwing the crossbars on there. That's another little birthday gift I got Meredith. Um, she's spoiled. Yeah, she's, those are Nike leggings or something. But um, yeah, they're looking good. I'm pumped. <laughs> all right, I'm all finished. Wow. Oh, it looks good. I got the roof rack on there. Or crossbars. What's that red thing? That's how you lock them. Mm, looks good. Yeah. Looks great. Looks pretty good.